What is good? Diamond Dynasty, baby. Y'all already know what's going on in this video today. We're going to be reacting to the tea room. A lot of you guys were spamming me to react to this video, man. So y'all already know what's going on. Also, I want to shout out to all the recent patron members, man. If y'all have not checked your email, check your email so y'all can get the next steps. If y'all want one-on-one -on -one coaching, y'all already know the Patreon link is in the pinned comment. Also in the description down below as well, man. And yeah, we'll get it popping. Anyway, let's get into the video, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell that your mama to tell Uncle Joey Stella Hope. Let's get it. So Armand did go <clears throat> out of town for a first time performance of his single, I Caught Ya, on the Sassandra show. Now, while there, of course, he took photos. What is the Sassandra show, y'all? I gotta look that up. ...with supporters. Now, one of the young ladies that he took a photo with, a blog page, is stating that they have a screenshot of Armand liking an inappropriate... Here we go, my nigga. ...appropriate video. Now, the caption states, hmm, something must be in the air as Regine is, is having, having a like, like and dislike unlike. battle with herself and Armand loving what he sees. So now what they're trying what? to say here is that Armand liked this video. Regine found out. She went on Twitter and started liking tweets that stated things like, you losing your mind about an N-word you ain't busy enough and stop thinking people f with you when in all actuality they only f so these are tweets that regine liked but what you can do for them so now again <clears throat> regine allegedly liked these tweets and allegedly went back okay like them <laughs> now armand then went off on twitter he tweeted that little fake ish can't stick lol they've been lying on me for the past eight years this, this shit ain't, ain't nothing, nothing new, new. Then he also said, I wonder what the post was. Comment down below. Let me know what the post was of. Like, what did he like? Since when do Armand like just MF and pics? The MFs that know me know I don't even address corny ish, but the fact y'all got to reach shows how bad the hate really is. Then he tweets when they need followers, they know how to get clicks and y'all a sit up and entertain the fake ish. And what's so bad is y'all so gullible to a effing blog page like they job isn't to lie. Then Regine also tweeted out. Ooh, we not two young people in love got y'all stressing and making up lies. Life gets that miserable. Don't believe everything y'all hear and see. Now I want to know what the post was of, guys. <clears throat> was it a bitch twerking? Was she popping her pussy? Like, what is the whole big issue with the post? I really want to know what that was. So is he claiming that he did not like that post? The young lady that was in the photo also spoke out. Now, she did take some photos with Armand. She stated, my boyfriend took these pictures, actually. <laughs> then she posted a message of someone stating, girl, Regine and her feelings about you. Well, the blogs were making it seem that way. I don't know why you even would say that, bro. Like, you know, like she know Regine personally. Like, she called Regine, and Regine said she was in her feelings and shit like that, and she was stressing about the situation. Then she says, well, the blogs were making it seem that way. Do you not know that the blogs don't know shit? All right? Have y'all not figured that shit out yet? The blogs only know as much as y'all know out there, as much as y'all see out there, okay? Every now and then, they might have a little connection to some more information, some more tea or whatever the case may be, but the blogs know just as much as anybody else knows, right? Which is not shit, because... We're not in them people's lives. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, what is she talking about? Way. And, the and these pictures look hella innocent. Like, people always gotta make something out of nothing, bruh. Always. Girl responds with, what the F? So then she posts a photo of Regine and says, Y'all, don't do me. I love me some at Regine. I wouldn't disrespect her. This is crazy. Don't effing play with me. So now the blog page that originally made these posts, their page was deleted. They went onto Twitter and stated, Apparently, this is what got my page suspended. My editor posted Regine's boyfriend liking this post, which he denies ever happened, but it's clearly him. They then came to my- My thing is like, if you like something, first of all, what was the post? I really, really, really want to know what the post is. So if any of y'all could shoot me a DM and let me know what the post is, 
So I could see, like, all right, man, maybe that nigga shouldn't have been liking that. But even if it was a bitch twerking, popping a pussy up, who cares, bro? We're talking about Instagram, fam. Like, why is it such a big deal? You know, like, I, I really don't understand. I don't get it. And on top of that, if you liked it, stand on that shit, right? I don't know if you liked it or not. But if you liked it, stand on that shit, fam. Like, I liked it. Reginae ain't got no problem with me liking it. So what? I ain't got shit to explain to nobody. For what? For what? You know? Or if he didn't like it, maybe he didn't like it. I don't know, guys. But I don't know if this T-Page just, like, edited that he liked it or if he really did like it and he just doesn't want to say he liked it. I don't know, guys. But if he liked it, there's no, nothing wrong with saying, yeah, I liked it, so what? So now what are you going to say? Regina still fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? This is internet shit. I don't see what the big deal is. You know, I really want to know what the post is. My page and reported it to hide the truth. He's a dog and that's <laughs> not a surprise He's at a all. No, it really whoop, all whoop. looked photoshopped to me, but I'm just here to Photoshop. Report, so you guys let me Oh shit, not Photoshop, man. Why are people coming at Armand like this, bro? Like what's the issue? Armand has been getting heat left and right, left and right. You know, people are trying to take him down and try to make him seem this way and that way. I really don't understand it. He seemed unbothered, like all he's trying to do is love on his girl, make some money be successful i mean and people are just coming out the woodworks trying to like cause his demise they want to see him fail for some reason man shit crazy you know what you guys think about that down in the comment section below now yesterday really i spoke on regine and savannah and how they unfollowed each other uh -huh. and regine may have made some tweets regarding savannah now savannah which is stevie j's daughter stevie. did go on to instagram live stevie. people were asking her about regine and this is what she had to say she should have put that he was a um i don't know how people ask him about regina uh. act like that's my little sister or something i don't know where she at a little spicy with that with that response it's my white it's my white home girl talking about <laughs> why are they asking about regina <laughs> i'm out the loop people ask my people people that nobody gives a whoa <laughs> now there's also some She's a little aggressive huh I guess they fell out, fell out. Who who are these niggas right here? T going a gunplay looking ass nigga. Who is this? Round on Zanique and her boyfriend allegedly cheating on her. Uh -oh. Now if you guys want to check that this ain't nothing new. That video out, I will <laughs> this have ain't the link new. to that video Happen every day, in the bitch. description. It is on my celebrity T page. Now okay. let's move on to this next topic with Ray and her girlfriend right. Lanasia. Okay. So there was an explicit video that Ray posted on her Instagram story. Of yeah. course, I cannot post it here but people for whatever reason thought it was actually neek in that video yeah well lanasia actually let everyone know that no it was definitely her yeah. oh my god that was definitely me mm -hmm. that was i know this is it sounds fucked up but when she had her head down i thought it was lanasia definitely her yeah. oh my god that was definitely <laughs> me Now, CJ, you better claim that ass, girl. You better claim that ass in that back. Is preparing for his you sneaker me? release. He did go on. Them don't look too bad. I ain't gonna lie to you. Shit. On to Instagram Live. Okay. To I like the colorway, too, and I like the bottoms. Answer a few questions and okay, CJ. show off his fit and how to style his new shoe. Are you guys gonna cop CJ's new frostbite? I don't know about copying them, but they look all right. I can't really see the whole, you know what I'm saying, what he got going on, but they kind of fresh. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Let me lie. know down in the comment section below. Shoes with them because they don't. They say, "Oh wow, your your fit is drippy. It is drippy." No, the fit's not drippy. It doesn't go with the shoes. We be dressing around here, you know. We ain't just like ranch. No, they don't go with your fit, fam. But you know, I can't really see the shoes. Get down close to see the shoes. <laughs> Get did. down there. Are we fucking like who is filming right now? Maybe he just got the got it posted up. You know I got shot. I'm still Oh no. We need to get the fucking shoes. We we have the fit. We don't have the shoes. Still wearing shorts with my shoes because it just go hard. Let me see the shoes. <laughs> Lindsay. What's your name again? Lindsay, uh I forgot what her name is, but she need to get come on now. We trying to get the product. Talk about that. Let's talk about that. I'm gonna stay loud a little bit. I actually got shot about seven weeks ago, 
in both of my legs. I got ricochets on my shoulder, my foot, and I'm just walking around. I'm traveling. I'm selling shoes. I'm promoting. I'm excited for life. And you guys got to understand. I can't see the shoes, though, fam. I'm trying to see the shoes. And they're coming from where I came from. I'm not supposed to be here. I'm about to be 34. I could have been dead and gone, and now I'm still here. You got to understand that I'm excited for this shoe, and I'm excited to be alive. And you guys should be, too. They give me like a New Balance Saccone type feel. For those of you that was wondering, that was concerned if I was going to make it or what was going on, and I made that initial. Bro, we know you made it. We glad you made it, fam. We glad. All right, let's see the shoe. Posting, I've been shot before any other thing was posted. For those of you that got scared. That means you have some type of connection to me, some type of connection with me. I could just smell new. I just love the smell of new shoes. I could smell them from here. You should want to support me. Um, Let me see the shoe. Good. That being said, you people I'm expecting to support me. Look at that. See this? I call this drip right here. This the drip. <laughs> yeah. This the drip right here. When they when I That's the drip. It looked like they got rained on. Like what the fuck going on here? Together, and I have to come. Let me see the tongue. Like what's the brand? This, 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 this. All this, all this, and this, I knew what I was doing, everything. Now, let me tell you one thing. I know some people... I mean, it's not a bad-looking shoe. I mean, this, the tongue part kind of looked like basketball. It gave me basketball vibes. He was saying things like, oh, damn, Brazilian? He said, stay strapped. <laughs> you know I stay strapped now. I would. <laughs> See, damn. I don't know why you weren't before. You know what I'm saying? Gotten all this jewelry on, and you know niggas be hating this shit in general. Why Why weren't you strapped up? I don't understand. Dan has a different platform. He can show his guns. He's been living a good life for as long as anyone can remember. And matter of fact, Dan, I'm going to DM you. I'm going to send you the shoe, too, because you, you actually sent me your book. You sent me a large case before of your merch. I'll never forget that. I'm forever grateful. I'm forever grateful for you. Follow me on Instagram as being as big as you are. The want. shoe's not bad, man. I'll probably give it like a like a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. Like, I think that's good. one. You're like the new you happening, so those of you that don't know. Comment down below, ladies and gentlemen, are y'all gonna go cop the CJ So Cool shoe? Let me know. Who he is. If you're probably a kid, you should I wonder if it's gonna be relate released in like retail stores or just like maybe just his website or something like that. Be looking, but for those of you that are those that don't know who that is right there, who I pent, he is the man for real. Uh -huh. the plan. That being said, I'm sending him some shoes too. And if he wear my shoes, Lord knows the world's going change, man. So you guys might want to get on top of it and get your shoes. I wonder, is that his signature right there? Before it's too late. Because if the right person get my shoe and they wear it and they actually like it like I do, then we're going to be the next easy. Question is, what is he going to sell them for? You guys are going to look like followers that didn't support early on. You'd rather be a follower or you'd rather be a transcendent? I'm a transcendent. <laughs> always have been, always will be. That being said, see the support is checking out with another live. They look comfy, though. I ain't going to lie. You know I don't go live, so this is very important for me. Hopefully you guys show up. And buy these sneakers. We gotta go. Hey, hey man. Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Shout out to CJ So Cool. Keep doing your motherfucking thing, man. I love to see it. Love to see it. Love to see it. Let me know how y'all feel. Are y'all gonna be copying the sneakers? And also let me know how y'all feel about the Armand and Regine situation, okay? Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you guys feel like Armand really liked that post? And if he did like the post, what would be so bad about it? Did anybody see what the post was before it was taken down? Please let me know because we need to get down to the bottom of this. We need to get down to the nitty gritty because I don't care what it is, bro. This is the internet, fam. If your partner is upset about you liking something, I don't know, man. Maybe y'all don't need to be together, man. You know, because people get so caught up in the social media shit. This shit is not real, fam. You know, what's happening behind the scenes? Do y'all have a good connection offline? Do you guys have an understanding offline? You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Come on. Anyway, guys, that is just my opinion. Let me know y'all's opinion in the comment section down below. I love you guys so freaking much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell the agent mama to tell the uncle Joey. Still a hoe. I will see you guys in the next motherfucking video. And I love y'all, man. Peace. We out, baby.